Yeah. One of the, yeah, memories of Guruji, you know, one of the, I guess one of the fondest memories I have of Guruji is right at the end of his life, um, Harmony and I had occasion to go up and see him and, uh, um, you know, his health was failing a little at that time, but um, we, uh, he was sitting at the edge of his bed and, and um, we were chatting a little and then, and then I think it must have been time for us to go. And I said to Guruji, I said, Guruji, this is the last time that we will see you. And he did his, uh, you know, uh, and he looks at us with those piercing blue eyes. And then he said, ah, uh, yes, correct. <laughs> and, uh, and then he did this funny thing, you know, he took his mala beads off and he started chanting a bunch of Sanskrit stuff that we couldn't understand. And, uh, it kind of felt really nice and special like it was a little blessing uh for us right at the end of his life so that's one of my fondest memories you know of him that i can think of right now um there was this one time we were having breakfast up in his house and it was the whole family was there just kind of sitting around having breakfast and and uh guruji just people were chatting and talking and guruji turned and he looked at me and we had this sort of like gaze, this stare, and he was just looking, penetrating into my eyes and I was staring back at him. And I just thought, well, I can't look away because <laughs> I'm locked in this gaze. And it was just this really kind of beautiful moment of just like, we just, I don't know, just feeling of presence and, and love um, and strength and just all these qualities that, that he had you know, just being really present in this moment of this sort of gaze. And um, I don't know, there's lots of different memories, but mostly it's just a feeling like when I think of him, I just feel this like a deep love in my heart. And he always, he always had that. He always would look at you and see you and not just, not like, not who you think you are. He would really see who you are. and and almost just like penetrate you with his stare and see into your deeper self and um, and I kind of miss that for sure. <laughs>